The United States pizza team sanctioned the Northeast Gourmet Pizza Trials, which were held September 17, 2017. Samoski's Home Style Pizzeria in Valley City, Ohio hosted 20 pizziolos, who each brought their best recipe to compete for a grand prize free trip to Italy to compete at the World Pizza Championship next year. Caliper of pizza makers at this, that showed up this year at, at the competition are unbelievable. Uh, seeing a lot of cool things, new things with the doughs. I mean, the flavors on these pizzas are unbelievable, unbelievable. Um, so it's awesome. Pizza styles ranged all over the board, from pan to wood-fired to deep-fried pizza frita. Roberto at Caste Pizza. He's one of my mentors. I watch many videos of him doing it. And then I got to see him in person the other day. I think I'm more stressed now than competing, having all these great pizza makers at my shop competing, using all my stuff. Um, but no, it's really cool. It's an honor to have everybody here. It's fierce. I mean, everybody's got great pizzas coming out. I mean, it's, it's, it's going to be a tough competition. We just make good pizzas and hope for the best. Toppings included a little of anything and everything, such as fresh seafood, avocado, figs, and even coleslaw. Okay. I'm doing a serrano, papadouce, capricoli, and I got tanned olives, so I figure we're gonna give that a whirl. See what happens. I mean, each one of them has a depth of flavor. You know, that uh, you, know, you can tell that the chefs are putting their time in and they're definitely looking for the best ingredients as well as great creativity. When the dust settled, Bradley Corbin was awarded the grand prize for his Detroit-style Korean beef pizza featuring spices, Korean barbecue sauce, cheese, carrots, and cilantro. I'm here with your winner, Bradley Corbin. Now, you've had a, a tough couple of years, so how does this lift your spirits? Oh, it, I'm on cloud nine right now. This has been the best week of my life. You've been to Italy before. You got on the pizza team initially by winning a championship. What's your strategy and goal going to be for competing in Italy this coming year? Uh, a lot more focused, uh, less nervous, and just come up with something simple to, to put myself up a little bit higher than I did before. Uh, just being familiar with the area, the competition, you know, just not being nervous. And I know what to expect. And, you know, being a little seasoned, it's, it's going to help out a lot. So for those out there that want to try your pizza, where do we find you? Uh, Sloopy's is located in Lakeside, Ohio, and we've got a second store in Port Clinton as well. Tori Truppiano of Oceanside, California took second place. I came to uh, Ohio to take first place, and they gave me second, but that's okay because that gives me a little bit of time to perfect this pizza for the next competition. Um, I was extremely happy with the way the pizza came out. Uh, I think the judging was very fair. I did taste the pizza that won. Hands down, that pizza was amazing. Um, I'm ready to do this again. Giovanni Labati from Illinois took third place. So I came in third place uh, with a, my jam in with Papa Pizza. It was a Peppa pizza with a pepperoni, creme de pecorino, onions, basil, combination of a lot of other things. And uh, you know, judges judge it really great. I had great notes on it. Nothing bad. Came up with third. Oh, it's, I'm humble even to get third. I mean, it was everybody had a great pie. Um, it was really tough. It was everybody that kept bringing a better pizza out every single time. For a calendar of U.S. Pizza Team events, news, and information, visit uspizzateam.com and follow them on social media.